All right, I just got my new Samsung Z Fold 6. My friends at Taurus sent me over some cases, or two cases and one accessory. And so this is the brand new Z Fold 6. This is a, an official Samsung case, and it's quite possibly the ugliest case I've ever owned. So we gotta fix it. My friends at Taurus are sending me some new cases so I can take care of this bad boy. My Samsung Z Fold 6 is the black one, which is probably less seen than the gray or white one, but I love it i think it's gorgeous i'm a big fan of the fold series but of course they can be breakable so let's check out our cases so my friends at taurus sent me this over so let's take a look we got two pieces of course the cases for the z fold 6 will have to even the official samsung one right is two separate pieces and look this is black samsung didn't have a black case this year which is why i'm glad my friends at taurus have a black case for me right because it like so for example i'll just slap that on really easy that's the front screen case Here's a prime example, right? So when I have the black phone on the back, maybe it doesn't make a difference. Maybe it's kind of, maybe you like this ugly color and the contrast, but on the front, when you have a black case, it kind of just blends into the black background, which I like a lot. See how much this sticks out? So when I'm holding the Samsung case, I always know what color case I have, and I don't like that. And let's check out the back. Oh, this is legit right here. This might be my everyday carry case. This is excellent. Look at that, so it's nice and clear. It's uh, like a frosted glass type here. What I really like is that the volume button and the power button slash fingerprint sensor are unencumbered. So now I can easily hit that fingerprint sensor. With the Samsung case, this guy comes up high onto the fingerprint sensor. So like, I don't always hit it just right when I'm see with the Samsung case. I thought maybe that was the phone, but I think it's very clearly just the case. Where's this one? Uh, every time, no problem. It's nice. And of course over here I have a wireless charger and a USB-C power cord. So you can see I can plug in USB-C just fine. No problemo. And then I like this Razer charger because it's purple by default or whatever color I set to, but it will turn the Razer Chroma ring when it starts charging. There we go. You can see it's Chroma. That means it's charging. You can see from the top camera, hit the charger. So it's nice. And since it has this little ring on the back, let me give this a shot. So this is not an official Apple product, but it's a MagSafe style charger. And boom. There we go. So now we're charging. This light's pulsing, so you know it's charging, and then it shows the charging here. So now you got yourself a great black case. It's well protected, smooth, but not slick on the back. You got a little fat lip. What's up, fat lip? For the camera bump, so we lay it down, it's not getting scratched. Same thing with the front screen. And you can easily get to your buttons. So it's very nice. Well, that's nice. All right, here we have our Taurus case. Nice packaging again. This one has an extra chamber for the S Pen, and again, the protection for the front screen as well. You can also put the S Pen right here. I don't have the S Pen, but again, they slap on very easily. Let's go bottom first, both sides. So again, you have the lumps up here that can hold your S Pen. You have easy access to your fingerprint and volume. Then we open the case all the way up. You have this little, I like these little guys. It gives you like a little grip to hold onto. And then this guy has a little kickstand. So now I can watch my favorite 5 or 12 video on full screen. That's nice. It even has the MagSafe action, right? So that's nice. Even though there's no circle on the back, there's a circle inside, so we'll magnetic charge. And of course, it's not plugged in. Let me plug it in. This will light up when you know it's charging, and then it shows it's charging right here as well. So that's good. Very nice. And then should be no problem. Plug it in the USB-C cable. Of course, it'll fit just fine. And then we already know it works wireless charging, but just so you can tell, just in case you thought it was a funky charger, let's try a second one. As soon as I lay it on here, it should start charging. There we go. Now we're charging good. All right, yeah. So this case also gets the big thumbs up. All right, so let's take a look at the Taurus mag ring accessory. Oh, this cool looking. So this is the magnet here, right? So this Taurus case does have a mag ring in the back. So I can just slap it on my phone and now this will magnetize on there. And now I got myself a little pop socket action. You know, it can hold it there, right? Or it can be a little kickstand, right? However you want it. But mainly it's like a little fidget spinner pop socket hold onto your phone guy. And it will pop off. Obviously with this big guy in here, it won't fit on the wireless charger. You pop it off and now it's wireless charging so this is a taurus case and it has the magsafe case in there already now you can see even without the phone i can just slap it in there but on the samsung case i already have it's not magnetic but i can slap this guy in there my samsung case is magnetic so yeah now kicks on there comes off obviously the thickness of your case will be a difference and i didn't take the tape off because i might use this other taurus case but if you wanted one of these on there of course it spins on it's very nice see perfect so yeah this little guy, I think it's a cool, I don't know if the moon or what it is, but it's cool looking. And of course the Taurus case is cool. So, all right, thanks to my friends at Taurus. I'm gonna give a big thumbs up again. All right, thanks.